Hello guys, it's me Z from a wireless solution and today we are going to work on another phone Moto E4 because in most of the video other people have complaints that they cannot um, receive the iMage setting and uh, some of the new software that 7.1.1 has new updated software so the older um, way is no longer support you so for that purpose uh, what we need to do is uh, we are going to put the password for the IMEI and I'm going to show you new new method how to bypass that one um, seven. okay let me connect it to Wi-Fi I'll show you that uh, it will say that this phone was being reset uh, and I'm going to give you the new method okay so you can see this device was previously sent and then uh, you need to have the same so what we are going to do we are going to go to the vision go to vision talk back turn on talk back Talk back on. Talk back is a screen reader primarily for people with blindness and low. Talk back tutorial. Talk back setting. Global context menu. Push the power Talk back. up and uh, Talk volume back up and down at the same items. time to suspend okay. it. Talk back suspended. Then you can go scroll down, help and feedback. Once you go to help and feedback, get started or um, click on this main screen, click on this arrow sign. Not arrow sign means a clock sign. You can see accept and continue. No thanks. And uh, here you will type V N R O M Venrom bypass Google bypass. Once you open, you will click here and it will take you to here. So you here you are. We are going to download two types of software: F R P Venrom A P P K. You will click on this one. Update permission allow okay uh, the other one we are going to download is a uh, quick master apk allow okay and open so what we are we can do is let me find if they have download options okay so now I'm just doing it download again the second time because it gives you option to open over here so now I'll open it from here install always so it will take you to the setting once it take you to the setting so you can come here you can activate the unknown or go to device administration and click on this one deactivate device administration so now as you are here you can click on this one click on here go to home setting once you go to home setting you, you, what you are going to do you will go to apps once you go to apps so from here you will go show system you are going to deactivate two things um, disable two things one is a uh, google play services so you will go down to g so it's gonna be facebook uh, google google account manager uh, disable you will go back and the other you will find is google play services disable disable app now you are going to go back to the main setting go down um, go to storage go to storage go down explore it will you will come here to downloads once you come here to download you will click and install this one the frpwinrom.net now once we install this one you will click done and the other we are going to download is the quick shortcut maker you will click on open here is all your apps you will come to the application 
you will come back to the application what you need to do is go down you will come to google play storage try this one now here we are going to put a new gmail account uh, that uh, like you can either create your new one or you can um, go with completely a new gmail account that is i'm putting my own so you guys can put your own gmail that you have with the password or anything else you have or you can even create a new one uh, so let me put the password okay you will hit accept and continue now close this one now you can see that the gmail is already inside there so you will go back go back from here you can go this to the setting from here or you can go to the setting from any, anywhere else uh, like go back complete to the setting main menu and you can go there so let's suppose you so here will be setting setting you can just go completely back to the main setting right and go to the apps again if you remember we disabled two apps uh, show system now if we uh, disable two kinds of app so one is uh, one was the Google will go down go down one is google account manager you will enable it go back the other is a uh, google play services enable it and uh, and now once uh, you enable it so you simply need to restart the phone It will take a few seconds once you restart your phone. So I'm going to pause the video because it may take a few seconds and then as it's restarted so I will be back with you guys. So now the phone is being re uh, restarted but what we are going to do is uh, we are going to go back suspend talk back. back suspended now let's go set up as new accept and continue it may take a few seconds one or two minutes for update uh, checking updates make sure you are connected to Wi-Fi And guys please uh, subscribe my page for more videos and uh, more information about the phones frp bypass uh, our google verification bypass and uh, for more interesting videos if you have any comments anything so just let me know you can see right now that was my gmail that i uh, put it in so you can just click next it will say getting it phone information each and everything and after that uh, you can go into the phone and just simply factory reset it again so everything will be uh, removed and you can use the phone as normal uh, it may take a few seconds and after that we uh, I'll show you to skip each and every step over there and just take to the main screen then you can go to the main screen and put like OEM unlock so once we need to turn that on okay so i pause the video because it take a few seconds you can go here just skip it skip it anyways because they are asking for like to fill your finger uh, your uh, password anything so you just need to skip these th these steps and uh,
okay so now once again what you need to do go uh, click on this one and once you click on this one you will go go to the main setting you will go to about phone once you are in about phone there will be software here is a um, building number so what you need to do click on building number like one two three four five six six time you are a builder now so you once you go back you will get another option over here de developer option click on this one oem unlocking click on this one enable once you click on this one enable uh, now you go back uh, go to okay guys so now we are here you guys need to go go to the setting back once you go to the setting back you will see here uh, backup and reset factory reset and erase uh, phone everything and once it's being erased and the phone will be restarted and you are good to go it's now the google verification bypass has been bypassed and you can use the phone as a new phone thanks for watching my videos and please subscribe my channel and uh, for more interesting video and if you have any question regarding to your phone so please subscribe um, write in the comment box thank you so much have a nice one enjoy your time